take out this titan as well there we go okay so today i'm going to be running the ox minos um a couple of you were actually asking me about this minos you know what's so special about it uh you know what's the difference between uh, this one and the uh, regular minos so when it comes to the difference if you take a look at the regular one this is a level 150 maxed out one uh 584 000, uh, health and uh, let's just go back to the ox minos you can see the health so Limited edition titans, it looks like, are going to have 10% more durability. It's kind of the same with regular robots and the limited edition versions of them. And, um, you know, what I'm going to do here today is I'm going to run uh, two games uh, with the Ox Minos using the Squall. Okay, and uh, we have Cannibal Reactors on here, Plated Armor. I think what I'll do is I'll play two games. The first game is going to have Squalls, and the second game I'm going to use Retaliators. So before I get going here, if you are new to the channel, consider subscribing if you haven't already. And if you enjoyed this video, make sure to leave a thumbs up. And uh, having said that, let's hop into game number one. Okay, so we've just dropped in on Springfield map and I have started with the uh, shell first. I'm just looking to see where my teammates are going. I'm going to go to uh, the center first. I'm actually going to take this route, not the other route, <laughs> because when you uh, run up the ramp like that, they are able to lock you down. So let's uh, make our way over to uh, this beacon here. And I think, you know, once uh, my Titan bar has been filled up, I'm going to drop in with the uh, Minos. I'm not sure why that player is trying to rush to that beacon there. He should have stayed with me in center here. Maybe, you know what, maybe he ran to the Nightingale to get healed up. Okay, so it looks like we're going to have someone attacking on this side. I'm going to try to push him back. Looks like they have, um, I think that guy's running Wasp. Yep, looks like Wasp. This guy might want to hide behind uh, cover here. I'm not going to uh, be attacking... I'm just looking to see what these players are doing. It looks like they are, are kind of trying to arc around here and flank us. So I need to, I need to try to push them uh, back. Let's try to get this guy. Trying to keep them away from the scent. I'm just looking to see where that other guy is. Incoming! Boom! Last stand. Nope, not on this guy. Last stand on him. Last stand on this one. Uh oh, uh oh. Must get him quick. There we go. The only thing with this kind of build is the reload. Yes, he actually he blinked back here. Okay, there we go. And now we have to deal with uh, this guy. Okay, so we have a uh, we have a shell incoming here. So what I'm gonna do is I'm gonna try to time this and launch him. There we go. Last stand triggered on him. There we go. And this looks like a hitchy here with uh, Tehrans. <laughs> I don't have enough rockets. He's gonna end up killing me here. Okay, so almost filled up, you can see. Let's um let's drop in with the blitz. So I'm gonna be dropping in with that uh, Minos very soon here. Uh, let me just try to lock this guy down. There we go. Another play over here. Need to lock this guy down as well. go are we getting that beacon <laughs> I'm kind of watching I'm kind of watching that side there because I know they need to get another beacon okay so we have this guy here 
take him out. Hold on. We have a couple of flanks to my left as well. This guy. Oh, we have no one at the center. Uh oh. That's not good. I thought we had a player there. I guess he got killed. Take out the hawk first. Ah, he went into phase shift. Come on, reload, reload, reload. Quickly. There we go. There we go. Take this guy out as well. Uh-oh, uh-oh. Heal. Man, it looks like we actually got the, the beacon. I still haven't dropped in with my, um, my Minos yet. So I'm going to let this guy kill me here. And you can see they have one Titan, two, possibly three. Now I drop in with my uh, my Minos. So my goal is going to be to see how much damage I can do in the amount of time we have left. <laughs> Which really isn't that much time. So do we have a... We don't have a Nodens here. That's going to make things a bit uh, tricky. Oh, wait. Hold on. This guy used his uh, shield. So he doesn't have a shield now. I did get suppressed, but I should be able to take him out. And man, I'm taking on a lot of damage here. A lot more than I wanted. Do we not have a Nodens or something? Uh oh. That's not good. Yeah, I think he's going to go. He's trying to go for this guy here. Yeah, I'm trying to see if I can get uh, closer to this uh, Nodens. He's going to uh, suppress me. I'm trying to take out this guy. I have to save up my uh, shield. So we're going to use that now. He's going to suppress me soon. Okay, so I just want to wait until that suppression uh, wears off. There we go. Let's take out this Titan as well. There we go. And let's do that. Uh oh, uh oh. Push this guy back. So the thing is, I have cannibal reactors. I don't have antimatter reactors, which means this is going to go on pretty quick. And, uh,. So if you guys are wondering why cannibal reactors over antimatter reactors, uh, cannibal reactors is very good against other titans. So I use it purely as a, I guess, a titan counter. Um, but yeah. You know what? This game actually lasted longer than I thought it was going to uh, last. Now let me just uh, quickly move to this guy here. I think I had a teammate here, but he got taken out. So I'm trying to deal with this uh, shell. And uh, also this guy over here. No. Ah. <laughs> We're all just waiting for him to get out of Transcendence. Okay, so... Gonna heal up my uh, teammate here. Looks like another Ravana making his way over to this end. We should be able to win this, so... We're gonna have a 4 cap here soon. And there we go. So I think that was a really good run. Um, I actually thought the game was gonna end by the time I got to get, you know, all my damage with the, uh, the Minos. But surprisingly, I was able to take out actually quite a few players with it. So... 4.9 million, 11 kills, 2 beacons in that game. Uh, this is how we stacked up. And in terms of the honor points, here are the honor points for that game. And uh, what I'm going to do now is I'm going to switch out the score weapons uh, on the Minos and replace it with Retaliators. And I'll see you guys in game number 2. Okay, so we've just dropped in on Valley Map. And I have started with the uh, Shell first. Just looking to see where my teammates are going here. Um, we have one going to the right. That's good. We have to be careful of these two players on the left. Okay, so I'm going to go for uh, this guy over here. We're going to try to hit him with our rockets. 
Yep, he's gone into a phase shift. This is good for us. Let's try to get him now. And the detonation. Nope. He went into phase shift again. Okay, there we go. I should be able to get a heal here soon. Hold on. There we go. Got that player. Oh, they have a camper. Let's just go for this guy. Free silver. Whoa. I saw something pop. I think it was his... His, uh... <laughs> the leg of his Raijing. There we go. Took him out. Gonna get this guy. Oh, jeez. There was someone behind me. He has another right. Oh, you know what? He's doing that task. I don't know if you guys know about that task, but it's for the event, and I think that's what he's doing. So, uh, let me just see. We have a couple of shells out there, so I'm going to use the Typhon next. Look at this guy. He's hiding behind you. I'm going to try to roast him up. Feel the burn. <laughs> there we go. Can we get this guy? Oh, I got him. I think I got him for my teammates. Yes. There's actually quite a few of them in this tunnel here. There we go. We can get this guy. Locked him down. Maybe take out that guy there. And uh, this guy phase shift once again. Wasn't he the one that went into phase shift earlier? I think it was him. A lot of phase shifting going on. Whoops. Targeting. Let's take out that guy. EMP this player here. He's now down to his last stand. I'm going to be dropping in with my Minos uh, very soon here because I noticed my uh, Titan bar is filled up. I'm uh, trying to get inside this guy's bubble. We're going to roast up this player here. And uh, try to EMP that guy. And uh, let's drop in with the Minos. So I actually have to be very careful here because if I get too aggressive and I get locked down I could go down very fast what is this player in I think that, that is that a uh, Ao Ming I think it might be let's try to no it's not <laughs> I'm shooting him <laughs> from this side <laughs> he must be wondering what's going on yep he went down the thing is, holy crap, man. Wait a minute, was that a... Oh, wait. This guy is in a Minos too. He has... So that guy actually has uh, the Cyclones. I'm waiting for the other team to drop in with their Titans. Let's take out uh, this guy. There we go. And that guy's taken out. We have a this Minos on the left side. He's being sneaky. We need to trigger his. So you see how he used his shield? So I'm not gonna fire at him yet. Hold on. We're gonna do that now. And then we're gonna squish him into the corner here so he can't escape. There we go. And let's do that. Take him out. Uh, we need like a Nodens quick. That's actually one of the things that you can do in order to really boost your uh, damage output. If you are a, a Nodens pilot and you see your team has Titans, one of the best ways is to actually drop in with your Nodens and start healing your, your teammates or the Titans as quickly as possible. You can really rack up an insane amount of damage that way. Trying to take out this guy here. I'm actually going to run around the corner because I'm taking on too much damage from this one player on my right flank. And um, I do want to actually attack this Arthur, but I can't do that just yet. He needs to actually move around the corner here. Do we not have a Nodens or something? I guess not. 
Okay, I'm gonna... I think I'm gonna try to take out this Arthur first. And then we will... Think about dealing with uh, the beacons here. Because we do need another beacon quickly. Um, he's going to that side. I'm gonna go to center. Yeah, this guy's gonna probably kill me here. I'm trying to at least change his beacon white. And I think... Oh, oh, oh. Shield, shield, shield. <laughs> I still went down. Okay, so we're going to use the... Let's use the Blitz. Because this has quite a bit of speed here. And we can get the uh, right beacon. So, the Retaliator build's actually pretty decent. I'm going to take out to this guy. We're going to get this beacon. Look at all the Ao Mings. Holy crap. Four Ao Mings. Are you serious? I guess the Ao Mings are coming back into play. So I did lock uh, this player down. I'm going to get this beacon, or at least try to. Heal. <laughs> Trying to get that heal in. Take out this guy. I think this might... That other guy might be a Scorpion. Sabo. We're going to get into the center next. Gonna lock this guy down. I'm gonna push the other beacon here because Yeah, look, he's he's getting ready to attack. But I locked him. <laughs> I'm trying to take out that scorpion. Come on, man. Oh Let's take him out. Someone's gonna drop in. Right? Over there. Maybe not. Try to lock this guy down. This should do it. Yeah, he's going to give the beacon to us. He went into phase shift. He's trying to heal up here. Come on. Holy crap. I think I hit that player all the way from this side. Yeah, I did. So we ended up doing 5.4 million damage, 12 kills, 10 beacons in that game. And this is how we stacked up in terms of the teams. Here are the honor points for that game. And there you go. Okay, so I think that's pretty much it in terms of this video. Thank you guys for watching. I hope you guys enjoyed this video. If you did, make sure to give this video a thumbs up. And if you haven't yet subscribed, consider subscribing. Until the next video, I'll catch you guys later.